type. I'm still adding uh, pieces from uh, extractions that I made from Maya, but this video will cover uh, the using of these uh, new tools available on ZBrush 3.5, which are the polish tools. You, now, now we have uh, uh, this so-called polish tools um, we have medium polish uh, soft polish and this high polish that I'm using here what this does is to create uh, a soft surface that's, that goes into a hard edge it's important to use this at a very high um, uh, at a very high subdivision level so it looks uh, pretty sharp on the corners as you can see here this polish tool is like giving me this soft surface that goes into a hard edge which it's going to it's going to make it looks look like um, like a metal piece like um, like a metallic uh, solid piece maybe I should use at this point a uh, metallic shader to see to see more uh, close closer to the effect closer to the to the render look that we are going to get after this polish this, this this is a very cool feature. It makes uh, it really feels like if you were polishing the surface. And it's great for creating this kind of sharp edges that exist on vehicles and metallic things. Those were not uh, previously available. And um, in the past, we, we can get this effect with any alpha or anything like that. Still polishing the surface. Can increase the size to get a very flat surface here. flat this spot to I'm gonna change to um, to a metallic shader to see how it looks I'll just add some polish here and there they're more tweaking And there we go with a metallic shader. So you can see that that surface really looks like uh, like a solid metallic uh, piece. It's starting to look very good. Go back to the high polish, a decrease in intensity, maybe the draw size to to keep polishing here. You can model all, all kind of mechan mechanical stuff with this. 
like uh, bike pieces or a car maybe and the new shares of uh, the new materials from Zbrush also looks great it's very easy to see how the surface is going to look on the final render with this material so I keep polishing and increasing the the subdivision levels of the mask too and the shoulders as you can see it looks uh, very good maybe I should smooth some parts let's see another shader with this which one let's see Chrome matcap, I like this one. It looks like a rubber suit. Yeah, it looks like some kind of um, rubber Spider Man suit or something like that. It looks very good. So, it, for previewing purposes, it's great. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope uh, to see you on the next one. Bye.